Hi there, and thanks for watching. I'm Jenna Bales. I'm a board certified behavior analyst in Ontario, Canada. And this video is going to go through how to chart a, a bar graph in Excel. So I've got some data already entered on the spreadsheet here. Uh, it's antecedent and consequence data for ABC data. Um, I am going to put it onto the same graph just because I find it easier to read that way than to have two separate graphs. So in order to create the graph, what you want to do is highlight the data that you want on the graph. And then you're either going to go to the insert tab and select your graph or you can also go to the quick shortcut up here to select your graph. Uh, I'm just going to do it this way since it's up and there, were, there is our line, our bar graph, sorry. So as you can see it's already listed out the titles for each section. Okay, I do still want to label The vertical axis. And this is going to be, in this graph, it's going to be frequency. I do usually change it into a percentage, um, but this really is just for graphing, not for transferring, so we'll leave it as frequency. Uh, the chart title is going to be say it's hitting. Okay, so there's our basic bar graph. Now in order to make this meet ABA conventions, there's a few things that we want to do. The first thing, we're going to click on the graph and select it. If this doesn't automatically come up, you want to go to your design tab to get it to come up. Um, but what we want to do is we want to change it into white graph because all ABA graphs are black and white. We're assuming that the people printing them are going to be printing on black and white printers so we want to make sure that they're easy to read. Um, next we want to highlight the grid lines. Just click anywhere on them and then you can hit your delete button. We don't include grid lines on ABA graphs. The next thing that we want to do is right click when you're on the graph and select format chart area. And make sure that you're on border here. Sometimes it might open up like that. Um, so make sure it says border. And we're going to say no line. We don't want it to be a line on the border. Okay. And that's your basic line, uh, sorry, bar graph for ABA. Thanks for watching.